yeah, the guys are outside. I just... Super, super psychic senses. I hear everything. I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> so, uh, yes, love energy. Um, source energy, I feel like, is very synonymous with love energy, too. Uh, love would sort of be like the state as well. But I do feel like source energy is love energy at the core. Because it's just a, a unperception, uh, excuse me, unbiased perception and state, really. So... That's just an aspect uh, within our consciousness. And once again, as I always say, as we raise our consciousness, we are able to experience more. And I feel, as we experience more, that love energy really just wants to just hold us and take us in and really become one. And, and when you live, like, with infinite love energy, you just feel so amazing. And you're just so connected and, and as I'm saying this I'm just being overcome with this energy it's just flowing through my body it's really amazing and it was really it started here with my heart chakra so we're going to talk about the heart chakra yes the uh, heart chakra would uh, be the chakra of love emotions and the way you feel about a situation really and sort of the way you feel about your greater situation uh, the heart chakra is the balance the bridge between your lower earthly chakras and your higher more spiritual chakras and um it's the balance of this energy so as you see i'm wearing green and pink a little bit of brown but you know green and pink are like you know the, the heart chakra is green so and pink is like you know you can't go wrong with that i suppose <laughs> And so, you know, that I'm, you all know that I'm a pretty big fan of, of quoting Jesus uh, <laughs> lately these days. <laughs> because I, I do feel like Jesus has a lot of good things to say. And, you know, one quote that always stands out in my mind ever since I, and it's really in my heart, ever since I was a child was, uh, uh, the, 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 greatest, uh, the greatest gift of love you can show to another is to lay your life down, you know, for them. And that quote just means a lot because at that point it's, it's unconditional. At that point, you're stepping outside of yourself and you're uh, accepting the ultimate fate of us all on this plane uh, of death. And, and you're willing to forfeit your spiritual lessons for another person. That's a lot. And, and, and one could say, well, what's the difference between that and suicide then? Because, you know, you're, you're choosing uh, to die at that moment. But uh, it's still pretty honorable, I, I will say, regardless. Because uh, obviously, you know, if, if you're laying your life down for another friend, there's a certain situation uh, involved. Um, I don't know, that's a tough question. But it, it's, it's, it's amazing. And, you know, sometimes I wonder, am I at a place in my consciousness that I would a actually do that for another? So love energy is always something that uh, can be learned and at, at every state. You know, like I said, just when you think you've got it all down, you know, something else will come your way and you won't know, like, how to respond or will you know how to respond. That's all if you're aware. So, I don't know. Uh, it's amazing. Um, love energy is also... Uh, something that can be really felt so like a lot of times when I give hugs to people I really just feel that energy radiating from their body and, and I've been really practicing working on energy and feeling energy as, as an actual force that exists and so I just feel like I'm so connected and it's just emulating from me and I just want to radiate to everyone and I just want to inspire everyone I just want everyone to see the beauty uh, of their existence, of their experience in, in, in this existence on this plane. Love energy is is just so infinite and, and I keep on stressing this and this is what is being given to me the message it is love energy for the earth plane it's very important uh, if you cannot love another being you're coexisting with uh, is this also goes within yourself too you cannot love yourself you are existing where's the, where's the lesson learned so you have to really uh, learn to open that heart chakra and learn to really have unbiased perceptions uh, of peace towards other people really I think that's just love energy and also having an unbiased perception of yourself and loving who you are and not placing conditions on yourself, not placing conditions on other people, uh, not 
feeling like you're trapped or like the universe isn't there wanting to connect with you or feeling lost and disconnected and angry and, and, and upset and like everyone's out to get you, you know. Remember, you are connected. You are source energy at the core. You are love energy. So radiate it. You know, like, like my girl RuPaul. This is why I, I chose that song, uh, because I just felt like it was just, you know, like a perfect song to, to, to do, and, you know, like, I don't know, like my girl RuPaul, so I just, I felt like the RuPaul song was like a perfect song, you know, to do, so I think uh, we will definitely play a little bit more, and thank you for checking out the show, and have a good one, okay? So thank you for checking out the show, peace, love, and light energy to you all. Thank you.